Good morning, good morning, good morning. I have 140 days until I graduate. So I was thinking, what if I try to do daily vlog almost every single one of those? And like I say, everyone, because that's just too difficult. And I should know, maybe it's not, we'll see. But it's currently about 9 a.m. Woke up uh, about half an hour ago. Honest truth, I've been staying up too late watching movies with my siblings and enjoying time with them. But that means to kind of cut because we've watched way too many movies. Baby Josiah, little brother, is probably going to attack the phone. No, we're not doing that. But yeah, I was thinking, try to daily vlog until I graduate. I think that'd be an interesting experiment and level up me in a lot of different skills because I want to do this. I want to set goals in the beginning of every single video and then at the end of the video, end of the day, keep me accountable to if I actually get them done. So today's goals. I need to finish all three thesis confirmatios. I'm going to continue with 75 hard, because that's what I'm doing right now. And then, I think those are the main two. 75 hard in those three confirmatios, because those three confirmatios are going to take a while. And, is there anything else? Yes. I want to edit the one other vlog I've shot from a few days ago, and catch up on 75 hard editing. Those will be the big ones. If I have time, I need to get, oh yeah, if I have time, I need to edit the... Oh, Josiah's over here. Yep, Josiah's right here. Okay, great. Well, I have to, you'll have eggs in there, there's some cinnamon buns, and then some... If I have time, I have to do the winter vlog edit, which you'll see what that is. All right, it is Bible time slash breakfast time. Let's eat. When you think you've got to worry, because it seems the thing to do, remember he ain't in a hurry. He's always got time for you. Oh, things have already changed. Just as I got hurt, but things have already changed. My family is headed off to the other side of town to our rental because a tree fell on it. And I'm going to go see if I can recover the wood to turn into some kind of business idea. So I'm headed over there now. I guess I'm not headed to the gym immediately. We're headed over there. Things are always changing. Ice is so much fun. I love just sliding around. So the purpose of why I came is because I'm gonna try to figure out how to turn this wood right here into some product or cut it up and make it into tables or just something to build and sell. That's the main goal. friend's place and pick up the kids and we're headed back over to the other side of town and I gotta get my first workout in and get starting to work because there's a lot to do and if you can't tell I'm still trying to figure out how to get the best footage to make this cinematic make this look cool because a lot of it's just like me talking like we're going we're going we're going because I'm not used to filming everything yet I guess that's a big thing so we gotta get home so I can get here We just got home. I'm headed out to the gym because it's like two o'clock right now and I had it to the first workout and where else is it possible? That trip that we just took over to the other side of town to go check on things was basically an absolute waste of time. There's no reason why I should have gone. I just kind of got guilted into it. Like, oh no, you should go. I'm like, okay, fine. And I guess big last thing out of that trip is I need to say no to 90% of the things that come my way because I need to focus and it's really not the place and time right now to go off those little trips. It's supposed to be like an hour long then end up being four hours. That's just not the, I don't have space for that right now. So that's the brutal honesty that I need to have with myself of I need to say no to most things and I need to focus on the things that will bring the results such as college, scholarships, 
work, business, working out, content creation, building relationships with people, not just going on every single little side project or thing that people are like, hey, you should come here, or my parents tell me I should do. Like, no, that was a waste of time. That was an absolute waste of time. So, lesson learned, but I've gotta get a lot of work done now because I need to fix my sleep schedule because I've been going to bed like 1 a.m., which is really bad. So, <sighs> such is life. You gotta learn from the lessons and the mistakes that you make. Just finished the workout and now we're headed home. It's almost three o'clock. It's three o'clock right now. Dang, that trip really took a lot of time. But so today we gotta get thesis. I work on thesis a lot. I already edited, did uh, three days worth of YouTube shorts and Instagram for setting five hard. So that's done. I want to get the vlog edited, but I gotta get uh, thesis done first. And then more and more things keep on a period of, oh, you should do this too. The mainly, right now, it is one, I actually don't really have a plan for what I'm doing in the gym or a second workout. Like, I'm really just messing around and like moving stuff. Also, today's workout had to go really fast through it, so I wasn't able to film that much because I got it to work. Why am I even sitting here still? I gotta get, get driving. But, yeah, that is where we're at today. So we're getting home ASAP, and then, Getting work done, getting school done. And I also have to memorize a poem. Forgot about that. Gosh, that's a do in two days. All right, well, we'll get it done. We'll get it done. the library. Now your two questions may be, why are you going to the library and to where did you get all that food or why? So, second one first, I struggle during 75 hard to eat enough calories. Doing two workouts per day is a lot. I'm eating, a, I need to be eating a lot more because I'm actually losing weight as I'm doing this. As I'm adding on some uh, muscle definition, I'm actually losing muscle size and I need to just eat more because it's surprisingly hard to fill up on calories when you don't eat carbs and sugar because that's a lot of calories that you're missing out on. And then number two, we're headed off to the library because as I've said before, I can't focus at home, not at all. So we are headed off to the library so that I can actually focus and get some work done and just probably gonna be there until it closes in like three hours or two three hours so that's gonna be good good solid chunk of work done on thesis for but I want to get the other stuff done too that's the thing I want to get the fun stuff done the fun stuff which like necessarily isn't what I would want to do for fun but I enjoy it I enjoy the editing I enjoy the scripting I enjoy the business I enjoy learning the sales I enjoy learning all this stuff and implementing it because this is what my entire life's gonna be based off of. It's not gonna be based off of some senior thesis that I write, even though I'm extremely thankful that I get to write it. I just gotta get that done and memorize a poem. I forgot about the poem again. You can't tell. My memory for things that I don't really, things I do not care about, my mind just, just goes out of my mind. So I gotta write that down. I <laughs> really gotta write that down. We're done there. I really realize how depressing a lot of Americans are. 
I didn't really realize that because I guess in the communities that I'm in, one, they're younger, so often more vibrant. But so many people in there were just so dead. They came in there and they weren't even like learning. So many of them were just on their computers playing games and on Instagram and they just seemed so depressed and so tired that, dang. So out of shape, it just hit me. I was like, I have been blessed with an amazing life and I gotta take it for what it is and make even better of it. Because that's kind of how I think it's. I've been blessed with an amazing life, but I can make it better and better and better. So we're gonna head on home and continue editing. I got Confirmatio's done. I only have part of one left. I'm gonna finish that up tomorrow. And then I got some of the video edited, very little bit. I need to finish that up when I get home. It'll be the vlog of day 17 of 75 hard. I think I'm on day like 22 right now or something. I actually don't know. I should probably figure that out. But this is the first of the daily vlogs for the 140 days before graduation. Oh, I also gotta work on this. Probably should start doing some sub mental exercises, which are, those are all exercises of the jaw and the muscles below because so you just don't have a little bit of flab hanging down. It helps strengthen jaw, which also helps with a lot of other things like breathing, etc. So we're headed home. We're home, yay. Time to see if there's dinner, get my second workout in and get editing done. I love that stuff. And then I got to read. The Laws of Human Nature is the current book. It's a long one. It's like 800 pages or something. Crazy, wow, I may have been covering the mic. Sorry about that. But we are home. Wait. I shaved, changed, and set up a studio and everything because I'm about to pitch a company to have me for a summer and college and maybe a little bit into this senior year job. That's kind of the pitch that I'm going to be doing right now and I'm gonna make a video proposal to them. I really hope I get it, but it's also because I used to always be against like, oh, I will never work for another company. No, that's not gonna be my end goal, but I need to get some experience under my belt, especially in this type of position that I'm going for. And I just think a lot of that was my ego getting in the way. I'm like, oh, I will only do stuff on my own. And I just need to do stuff and get experience. And experience will make me better. So that's the goal. I'm gonna film this right now. Let's get to it.